I'm Joe Oteo, Technical Trainer with Bosch Automotive Service Solutions, and today we're going to take a look at changing a run-flat tire with a TPMS sensor on the new TCE 4275. First thing we need to do is break the bead. When breaking the front side, it's important to note the position of the TPMS sensor. It should be 180 degrees around from where you're breaking the bead. After the rim is clamped to the machine, we can use a top roller to pre-lubricate the top bead. After the top bead is pre-lubricated, we can remove the top roller, position our mount demount head, and roll it off the rim just slightly. We can use the bead depressor to hold the bead down in the drop center on the opposite side. Note the location of the TPMS sensor just before the mount demount head. This is going to ensure that it's not damaged by the bead when it's pried over the rim. To remove the bottom bead, we're going to use the roller. Note that the TPMS sensor is going to be in the same location. Once you see the roller pop up above the rim, you can simply roll it to remove the bottom bead. And the tire is now removed. To mount the tire, you want to apply a generous amount of lube to both the front and the rear beads. To seat the bottom bead, angle the tire onto the rim and bring in your mount demount head. Note the location of the TPMS sensor at about 6 o'clock from the mount demount head. Again, this is to ensure that it's not damaged by the bead of the tire when installing. After the top or bottom bead, sorry, is installed, we're going to install the top bead in the same way, and again ensure that the TPMS sensor is in that same location at six o'clock. We we'll use our helper to hold down the bead in the drop center, and we just simply rotate. Note the location of the TPMS sensor just before the final portion of the bead drops into the rim. The position allows it to be protected from the bead damaging it. So once the bead is finally seated into the rim, the installation is complete. And as you can tell, the TPMS sensor was protected all the way around. This concludes the install of a run-flat tire with a TPMS sensor in the rim. 